Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Simon, it's about football. MTN 8 Cup competition, Wafa Wafa. Kaza Chips won, Mamelodi Sundowns won. I think it's an advantage for, uh, for Mamelodi Sundowns rather. Scoring an away goal, it is an advantage. Well, it's gonna be a difficult task for Kaza Chips. Some people are saying that, oh, Kaza Chips is going to make it, Kaza Chips will win in Pitora and stuff, but I don't think so. I mean, looking at the way they approach the game, against um Mamelodi Sundowns it was very poor to be honest with you for the entire first 45 not even one shot at goal one shot on target not even a single shot this is absolutely poor I mean left and take what are you doing man you are playing you're playing a low block and then you are playing pressure you're inviting pressure against Mamelodi Sundowns a team that makes a lot of passes a sequence of passes a team that is able to penetrate and then this is absolutely bad so when I look at my, Chips, I, I don't think they're going to make it. I don't think they will, they will approach the final. It is absolutely bad. Well, in the middle of the park, you've got Danzani, you've got Castillo, you've got Mark. And then to be honest with you, I don't think Danzani is delivering anything. The guy is not doing anything. I know I've got nothing against this guy. He's been brilliant at, at Barocca. He's been amazing at uh, Cape Town City. But he, for now, is absolutely bad. I don't think he deserves to be in the first 11. Um, yeah, man, can you rest him? Rest the guy and then you find somebody who's going to link up with uh, Castile and Mart. Because, I mean, speaking of Mart, the man is, he works hard. He makes a lot of running. You need that energy. And then Castillo is a ball player. He's good, the guy. He's a baller. He is a baller. I mean, good signing for Kaiser Chiefs. I mean, scouters deserve their flowers. He's absolutely brilliant. So if you can find somebody who's going to play with these two guys, they will give you something. Find something. Maybe try Ngobo. Try do Tabalala, man. Instead of Mdantani. He's not giving you anything. That is why you find it very difficult. I mean, for Kaza Chips to have the fluidity in the middle of the park. And then, I'm not sure maybe I'm the only person who's seeing this thing. But for me, Mdantani is doing nothing. He needs to rest a little bit. And then, let me take with your low block, I mean relying on a counter attack, it's not going to work every time. It's not going to work every time because teams like Mamelodi Sundowns, they are capable of closing all the spaces. They need somebody who's going to frustrate them. Why don't you frustrate them on the on? I mean, based on your wings, because you've got Pontan, you've got um um, who's this guy? Modi. These guys are brilliant. But uh, you know, also <laughs> you are taking them out. What are you doing? I mean, what are you doing? You're taking these two guys. They're brilliant. They're key players. I mean, they're giving you something good. Then they, they understand each other together with this guy uh, to praise. But uh, the moment you do that, and then especially after scoring a goal, you want to defend. For what? Play whatever that is good. Give players a chance. Let them, I mean, uh, uh, um, exercise themselves with the gift and with the abilities they've got. Then they will frustrate Sundown. Because one thing I've realized is that so many clubs, so many teams, so many coaches, when they play against uh, Mamluri Sundowns, they apply low block. They don't want to approach Mamluri Sundowns. They don't want to try to uh, play counter pressing. I mean, the only team that have tried that so far is uh, Chippa United. Unfortunately, they've lost, but they've tried to make some counter pressing, which is absolutely good. It's a pound to pound playing. Instead of, I mean, making a low block, you want to rely on a counter attack. I mean, those things is not even happening. It seems impossible against Mamelodi Sundown. So I think this is one of the things Kaza Chiefs should at least try to change on the on the on the second leg. Maybe they will claim something, but as for me, I don't think Kaza Chiefs will make it. Uh, no, 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 I don't think Kaza Chiefs will make it. Yeah, Mamelodi Sundown, it is. A, a big club is a brilliant club. I mean, but some of I mean, in, in some in some situations, we allow uh, Mamelodi Sundown to dominate uh, so many uh, teams. I mean, the 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 way they are approaching, the way they are playing, it, it becomes a bad thing. So for me, I see Kaiser Chiefs out. Yeah, <laughs> I think Kaiser Chiefs out. I mean, Mamelodi Sundowns they are doing super awesome. I think I think they're gonna play final with um, all on the Pirates. Yeah, I, uh, I'm sorry to say this. I mean, the way they're playing, it's pretty poor. Defensive-wise, they are good. In the middle of the park, it's there and there. They're lacking there and there. But if they can fix that and try to make some passes and share the ball, make sequence of passes, penetrate, contribute, man. Come on. I mean, share the ball. Play according to your talent. Play according to your ability. Instead of making some... Uh, 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 
inaccurate passes, not even short, you're not even making, I mean, you're not even making uh, a beautiful passes. Oh, that's too, that's too bad. That's too bad. So many things need to be changed. I mean, to be honest with you, if they continue like that, I don't see them going anywhere. I don't see them going anywhere. I thought Nefitseki would bring something incredible, but I think that he's still doing the same thing like those other coaches.